Large family cars aren't generally very exciting, and Skoda's new Superb doesn't even seem to try to buck the trend. But while the predictable design won't get anyone talking, the car has one feature that will. It's boot. Now you're probably wondering what the heck I'm going on about because this car looks like a normal, rather impractical saloon. But if I shut the boot lid, press this button over here, I can do this, which is actually really rather clever. But a clever boot isn't enough to warrant buying the thing. It needs to be good to drive too. Sadly though, the superb chassis doesn't exactly set the world alight. I mean, it does stay stable in the corners, but it doesn't have any kind of sense of fun or involvement in the same way as, say, a Ford Mondeo does. On the plus side, though, the ride is actually rather good, and it's important on a car of this size. And also, you can select it with Skoda's rather good DSG paddle shift gearbox. And I'll tell you what, even though it's 1,200 quid extra, it's a must-have option. The Superb will go on sale next month starting from just over 15 grand. Now it's not as good a car as a Ford Mondeo, but it is pretty good value for money. You'll be able to get it with a choice of three petrol and three diesel engines. Our test model had a two litre TDI diesel engine with 138 brake horsepower, and this engine probably gives the best balance of performance and economy. 